Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel and today I am going to film um, how I do my like foundation face routine. So if you want to see how I go from this to this, then keep watching. Okay, so first off I'm starting with the Smash Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. So I'm just blending that into my face and I am going to make sure that is all in there and there's no like blops of it anywhere so my foundation doesn't apply funny. Next we're going to go with the Benefit Erase Paste and number one I'm applying this with my Marc Jacobs The Conceal Brush. First I'm coming up, uh, covering up a few blemishes and then I'm going to move on to my eyes. I cover my eyelids as well because my eyelids are extremely dark. Concealing my dark eyes is something I always take the time to do because it makes such a difference with me. This Benefit Erase Paste is something that is currently in my project pan. I will link that video down below in case anyone would like to check it out. Now on to the foundation I've been using exclusively lately. It is the Bobbi Brown Skin Foundation SPF 15 Color Zero Porcelain. And I apply that with my Tarte Airbrush Finish Bamboo Foundation Brush. I use three pumps of the foundation, dot it on my face, stipple it onto my skin, and then blend it in. I love the finish this brush and foundation gives my skin. It looks so natural and it like looks flawless. To set my foundation, I use a Quo powder brush and use my CoverGirl Clean Sensitive Skin Press Powder to set it. This is in my Project Hem Pan as well. So I just uh, powder all of my face, kind of blending it in, making sure it looks good. Then I take my Besame Brightening Vanilla Powder to set my under eyes. I just um, tap out some of it into the cover and then I use the poof that comes with it to pat it under my eyes. After that I take my powder brush and just swipe off the excess. Also got a little on my shirt. Oh well, it happens. Now I'm going to take the Too Faced Endless Summer 16 Hour Longwear Bronzer. So you can see I'm lining up my face because when you apply your bronzer, you don't want to go in closer to the center of your face than where your eyes start. This will make it look a lot more natural for your bronzer. Now I use a Quo bronzer brush to apply this. And I also want to remind everyone, don't forget to blend into your ears, hairline, and neck with your bronzer. It will really make it look more natural and not, you know, harsh lines. Uh, also, I'm so sorry my bra straps were showing the whole time I was filming. I didn't even notice. So next, I'm going to go into my blush. I'm using this MAC one in Well Dressed. I love this blush so much, um, yeah, I probably overdo it with my blush, but I just love it. It's so nice, it's so, it's just a perfect color for me. Now we are on to highlighting. So I'm using this L'Oreal True Match Lumi N202 Rose, and I applied this with the Quo Fan Brush. I've been loving highlighting my face recently, and this was featured in my September Favorites. Now the final step is the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. You missed and we're done! Okay, so there is my face. That's how I do it. At the end, I just put on the Lasting Finish by Kate Lipstick in number 45, the Revlon stuff. Looks like that. I hauled this in my mini drugstore haul. So, mm, hope you guys all like my face and I'm about to film my eyes, which will be a separate video, so stay tuned!